helped me. I got a sectional for you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thank God I woke up, still gotta roll up, make a cup of joe, then I proceed to smoke. Take a shower, brush my teeth, looking like ooh we No days off, gotta stack this money. See you bitches trying to get just like me. That's a truest form of flattery. The couch is here. I look rough, y'all. I'm gonna come right back with the couches here outside. I'm gonna put it right there. Right there. Okay. One second. Nelly, we got a couch. Yay! Look at that man. Mm. <laughs> He's laughing at me. I'm too hype about this couch. <laughs> When the FedEx man is like, I got a big ass section for y'all. We gotta move all of this stuff out the way. Oh, y'all.
All right, this is the final of the couch fresh from Wayfair, okay? It's actually the perfect size for this size apartment. If you had any bigger of a unit, I probably would recommend a bigger couch, but this is perfect. Like if it was any bigger in here, it would be too much. So I'm really excited. It looks really good. The color is exactly what it was online. And the build wasn't that bad. The only thing that I want to change is the gold feet. But honestly, I'm not mad. Once I get a rug, which I'm about to go right now, it'll all come together. So, oh, and I want to add this. I got this yesterday. So I got this pillow yesterday from Marshall, or it's from Ross. And it was $10. It used to be... $88, so very much so a bop, and it just, ah, it goes so good on the couch. I can't, I'm about to get some more pillows and a rug. Be right back. Guys, I am about to go to Home Goods and Home Depot. Excuse me for my lisp. I am talking really weird because my retainer's in. But I am about to go to the store to get pillows and hooks for my plants. So definitely stay tuned. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we're about to get the rest of the decor for my couch. So let's go. Oh, y'all didn't catch my OOTD. I got my little wrinkly shorts on, but cute for a little store run. So I actually ended up getting some smoke salt. If you never been in Home Goods and didn't go to the food section, I don't know what you were doing. Cause they got some good gems over here. But yeah, definitely, definitely here for one and one thing only. I cannot get too distracted. So let's focus. to get the hooks for me to plant, plant, hang the plants. Um, and I have my pillows with me. All right, we're getting Home Depot realness. <laughs> okay, waiting on my lift so we can get out. 
and go home. All right, what's up you guys? I am back at the crib and we are about to put these pillows on the couch. So hopefully everything goes all together. The color story, the shapes, everything is just cohesive because honestly, it's a little lonesome over there. Like I have no decor right now. So I do need to hang some things on the wall, which will probably be in another video. So stay tuned for that. But I did get a throw blanket, a couple pillows, some candles, and the hooks so I can hang the plants on the ceiling. So we're gonna try to get into that. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe on the video if you ain't already with the gang. Go ahead and do that right now. Like literally go ahead and do that right now. And let's get into the rest of the video. Okay, so this is, the pillow I think I didn't show you guys. It's just a long geometric shaped, different textures on there. It's so cute. I thought that it would look really, really good with the pillow kind of in the middle. And then like this kind of on top. I don't really know how to like style this. But Something of that nature. And then this is the other one that I showed you guys on the camera that I got for literally like $12. Really, really good quality. Love how like textured it is. Again, and this one I think I'm gonna put like in the corner. I don't know. There's not like much room on the couch. It is a smaller. I'm gonna show you guys, hold on. So this is kind of what it's looking like now. I feel like I need one more pillow right here or like just a small one there and like one there. I don't know. It looks a little empty still, but I do like the color story together. I don't think it's horrible. That little pillow that I initially got is kind of random now that these kind of look like a set, but maybe if I get another pop of color, it can go over there or something. I'm not sure. But yeah, this is what it looks like right now. I'm gonna go ahead and throw the throw on there like that y'all like that throw the throw and then that'll be the finishing touch on there and then maybe we can hang some plants up here so let us see okay, really quick i wanted to show you guys for the hooks i have the plant holder that i actually wanted to transfer one of my plants in but i'm actually a little nervous because it's used to being in a holder where it can have drainage i actually make shift this and kind of tied it with some thread because it came with the planter without like the holder at the bottom. So there's no drain capture, there's just, it just goes. So I actually just put some Tupperware and tied it with a string, but we want to give her a little upgrade. So I was going to put it in this one um, and then just leave, you know, this one as is because it's pretty aesthetically pleasing already. Um, it blends in, it's whatever, but I did want to just put them maybe one on each side, that'll fill up the space, or I'm going to put it like kind of together on this end. So don't know, you guys put in the comments which one y'all like more, because honestly I can switch them around if it ends up being like this, or if I put them like this, because truthfully this area which I can show you guys. Next to the couch, I wanna put like a little end table or a chair. I'm not sure yet. Might be an end table, might be a chair, but either way, I wanted to have a little moment on this side of the couch. Yeah, we'll see what happens, but I'm just gonna hang these for now because I do have work in like 20 minutes.
little bigger so he might get bigger. Excited to see what he does. I hope I didn't ruin any of his roots though because when I squeeze it in, it's smaller at the top and then wider at the bottom. And I had to push him in a little bit, but I'm about to hang him with this hook and then we're done. All right, you guys, I just wanted to show you guys the finishing touches with everything up. I found my plants hanging there. We are gonna find a covering for that box because honestly, I don't even know why they put the Wi-Fi plug in the middle of the wall, but that's neither here nor there. Justin made a little custom box shelving. I just need to find some type of covering for it because it still looks a little out of there. Like it just looks stupid. So we're gonna cut that and then maybe do a different bed for Nelly because that wasn't even her bed and it's black and it doesn't match with anything. So yeah, now we got our candle on the table that I showed y'all as home goods. Um, I'm actually going to be customizing this table. This was my paint table. So I'm gonna actually sand it down, paint it and then epoxy it. So that should be a cool little project. I'll show y'all that DIY. And yeah, this whole wall is actually gonna be painted soon. I just need to find the colors. And I'm gonna be doing the mudroom wall. So these kind of things are just things I'm probably gonna end up putting in there or like on the shelving once Justin puts those up. It's gonna be wall art and shelving kind of everywhere throughout the wall. I wanna do a dark green and a light green or a light green and a dark green kind of contrast there but just something to liven it up when you walk in so maybe a light green here and like the slightly darker green there um and yeah this is how it's looking as of right now that mirror will probably end up in my bedroom or somewhere else because i want to get a circle mirror and an entryway table there so mudroom's almost done just need a pillow there and yeah that'll be all together this is already almost done. We just need that paint on the wall and maybe a coffee table or a chair. So y'all let me know in the comments what y'all think I should do with the space. As far as the kitchen, that's a whole nother thing. I have a huge island that I have just a bunch of random stuff on it because I don't know where I want these kind of things to go, like pictures, candles. These are probably the only things that are gonna be staying on the island um don't mind the dishes but yeah that's what it's given right now one more time for the one time so thank you guys for watching that is a wrap on this video make sure you stay tuned for the next video when i'm judging up everything else for all the diys that is coming soon for the apartment I also got to do my office, my bedroom, my closet. Like, we going in, okay? So, stay tuned for that. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching.